Hello folks, my name is Rojo, and welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. When we last left off, we sorted out the uh, the tape for Isaac, and now we need to go sort of uh, find the source, the real source. However, we do have a couple things uh, left to do in Hollywood here before we do something like that, so my thought is maybe we'll take this episode, <clears throat> excuse me, and uh, make it maybe a little bit of a short one, and just kind of clean up uh, the rest of Hollywood here. So, to do that, we need to go, yeah, it's on the other side of town, we need to go check in with Vivi, and we also need to go and um, check out the Asp Hole, which is right over here, because uh, we, haven't, we haven't popped in there yet, and that's somewhere that uh, I've been intending to go for a while, but... Just been distracted with so many other things to do out here, so in we go. Let's see if she has anything interesting to say. I've also got some XP that we're probably gonna spend on something here in the not too distant future. In fact, why don't we do it now? Um, I'm gonna need some more scholarship to read the books we have. We have one that we can't read right now. Uh, not that we would probably be able to use it anyway, because I think it's a computer book, as I recall, and we need computer four to be able to use it. So, uh, I guess firearms will have to wait for a bit, for a little bit. For now, let's get the, let's get this point of scholarship, and that will get our research to seven, or persuasion to seven, both are pretty important for being able to do various things. Alright, what's up? Look who's back. Yeah, about that. Please, call me Vivi. Oh. I guess I miss miss push the button. That's fine. So about Hatter, mm -hmm. he uh, he's fine. Here's the screenplay. Oh, I suppose I should just tear it up. But I just I can't I can't rip up the product of that man's soul. Here, would you tear it up for me? Oh, good God! <laughs> Do it yourself, you pompous poseur. Toriador Crybaby. Seriously, but sure. Thanks. Alright, I found out the name of his source. Are they? I mean, did you? It's taken care of. It must have been difficult. But take some comfort in knowing if you hadn't, someone else would have had to. I do appreciate your help. A lot. All right, masquerade redemption that we definitely didn't deserve. Uh, but yeah, baby, how much? Can't you tell? I simply adore you. You're so sweet to me. The way you protect me. What would I have done had you never come in here? Oh, why can't they all be like you? The world could be so, so beautiful. Here, take this. A reminder of the beautiful girl whose heart you stole. All right, thank you. We got Vivi's autograph photo. Well, all right. I may be delivering a memento of moi to your Haven computer, but uh, this should tide you over for now. To our Haven computer, huh? <laughs> Very well. Do so you have anything else to say? Look who's back. All right. Couldn't stay away, could you? Uh, I can watch me walk out. Unfortunately, I'll have to be back. All right. So it seems our time with uh, VV is at an end for now, maybe forever. Not sure. Um, since we're here, and we probably I don't know if we'll actually come back. Let's see. Where's that lady at? Yeah, you. What's up, darling? Hey there, handsome. My name is Misty. Can I interest you in a private dance? I've got something special in mind, just for you. Uh, yeah, obviously I'm interested. Great. Now <laughs> all I need from you is $100, and then we can go back and get things started. Oh, that seems, uh, completely reasonable. Uh, well, I guess we don't have the persuasion, we can't dominate her, unless maybe we say we're a little short on cash. Uh, let's see, I'm a little short on... Let's, let's try, sure. What? Then I'm a little short on time, sweetheart. Sorry, but I don't give up these goods for free. Um... Oh, man. Oh, I understand. 
You do that, sweetheart. A little deodorant tonight, maybe, baby? Mm. <laughs> Hi there. Good to see you again, sweetheart. Wanna have a little party? Just you and me? Sure. Great. Now all I need from you is a hundred dollars, and then we can go back and get things started. Sounds good. Okay. Now follow me back to the private rooms, and we can get a little more comfortable. All right. If we had a uh, higher persuasion or dominate or maybe seduction, we might have been able to convince her to. Uh, Go a little easy on us on the price, but I mean, look, we're we're loaded. I don't think we really need to worry about it too much, and we we're missing one point of blood, so you know, there's that. There we are. Now, what would you like me to do? I just love a man who tells me what he wants and how he wants it. Uh, we got a secret to tell you. And there we go. Well, that was worth it. Good job. You, uh, you've proven useful. Was it worth it for a hundred dollars? No, no, it wasn't. But it's just another part of the game that we get to see, so that's good. All right, moving on. Oh, no, sorry. My mistake. <laughs> uh, moving on this way. We will, uh, we'll go check out the club. Uh, or the other club, I guess. Friday Night Dead Rise, Saturday Ghoul Town. Very subtle. Very subtle indeed. In we go. Alright. Look at this deus ex looking motherfucker. Just uh, casually carrying around a katana on his back, because, uh, you know... I carry mine around everywhere. There was a watch there and it disappeared. Buggy shit, man. <laughs> it's like the second item has disappeared on us. Unless we actually picked it up, but I don't think we did. Either way, I'm not super worried about it. So it's a nice enough place, I suppose. But I think we will uh, keep exploring here. We got some kind of dude there. He's chilling. What are you in the bathroom? Uh, not really. It's a shiny stall. Very shiny stall. And that's a back exit. Some kind. There's a stage. Yeah, baby. Um, hmm, I thought there was an upstairs somewhere around here. I haven't found. Oh, there they are. I was just saying. I haven't found the stairs yet. Somebody up here that we want to talk to, I think. No. No. Here we go. This guy. You Ash? Present. Oh, cool, man. Nice to meet you. <laughs> I bet. What's your problem? The sun's gone down. Uh, yeah, it tends to do that. Never mind. I don't like your attitude. Me neither. Cool man, cool man, cool man. Uh, listen man, I don't want to hurt you, but I will. What's the catch? Uh, is there something wrong here? To say yes would be an understatement. What do you care anyway? I could just do it. I just walk out of here and do a legend. Maybe I live, maybe I don't. What's the difference? Uh, you're not making any sense. You didn't see them? See who? Hunters in front, back, inside my club. I try to leave, they'll move on. So I had to ask myself, if I go out there, am I prepared to die? How many could I take out before the killing stroke, huh? Two, three. I could just walk out there right now, blaze of glory, the end. And you know what? Knowing that, it doesn't bother me. And I guess the only reason I haven't walked out yet is because I'm trying to figure out why it doesn't bother me. Um... Maybe I could help you. Let's see. Aren't you worried about what Isaac would think? It would break Isaac's heart. It's good to know some good would come from my death. Oh, man, it's, it's dark. You don't like him, huh? That story would take too long to tell. Suffice it to say, we haven't seen eye to eye on too many things lately. And it's pissed Isaac off. To know. Uh, for instance? 
He kept saying I should keep a low profile. He kept saying I was attracting too much attention to myself. Well, he's not wrong. Uh, you should have listened to him. You don't know me. I can't sit in an office all day and play Hollywood from the shadows. That's Isaac's thing. I'm an actor. I was an actor. I, I don't have anything anymore except this club and some fame and this curse. Uh-huh. So why don't you ask Isaac for help? <laughs> Isaac helped me. Oh, it's a laugh. <laughs> he wouldn't be caught within 500 feet of this place. Not with hundreds of Just the thought of asking him for help. That smug curl of those poison lips of this. Not in this lifetime. Uh-huh. By the way, I apologize he's so quiet. I'll see if I can uh, up the... The, uh, the volume a little bit in post, although the song will bleed in a bit. But anyway, maybe I can help you out. Hey, did Isaac send you? Nope. What the hell, then, would be your motivation to help me? Oh, that's a long story. Uh, let's see. Um, money, and I know you got some. Fine, I've got tours of the stuff. My life's so goddamn easy because of it. So, how do you get me out of here to cash in? Let's see... Hmm. We've got a couple options here. We could switch clothes with someone in the club, but we did see a guy who looked kind of like him. Uh, alternatively, the more fun option, I think, is possibly, uh... We could escort you through the sewers, and we might have to fight. Are you sure about that? I don't know that you even out the odds a whole lot, but just maybe we'll make it out alive. Are you ready right now? Um... Yeah, I'm ready right now. If I make it past the hundred, I'm getting the hell out of town. Let's head into the sewers. All right, I'll follow you. All righty. So switching clothes uh, is, is a fun option. Uh, basically, does not end well for the man whose clothes uh, were switched. <laughs> uh, and I think we lose some humanity for that. But uh, this is the more in-depth option, I guess. Uh, let's go ahead and get out something. A little something something. Because we're going to have to deal with some people here. Man, that's actually a lot of damage. Let's see. Blood heal. Where's our shield at? There we go. That's what we need. These guys are not any hunt. I mean, I guess they're hunters, but they don't look much like hunters. I'm gonna have to, uh... I'm gonna have to heal up a little bit here. Is there anything interesting in here? Where does that go, I wonder? Hmm... So we can't even go that way. What about this way? We can go that way. But let's uh, let's try this door first. I'm just curious. Does this lead back to the club or something? No. Yeah. All right. I want to. Uh, I want to see what's going going on down this uh, this alternate pathway here. Ash, I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> we actually literally can. He's got. Uh, yeah, I think he's a Toreador, probably, so he's got presents on or something. There we go. Alright, let's do uh, one more... Where is it at? Blood heal. Mm -hmm. Just for good measure. There's actually nothing down here. It would seem we can't go this way. Very well. Yeah. Can't, uh, can't escape the easy way, I guess. That's fine. We, uh, will probably have to bite one of these, uh, these hunters if we get the opportunity. That's possibly doable for us. We have a pretty good, pretty good unarmed skill. Not the best, not the worst. Hmm. Sewer pipes there. There we go. Well, that makes that easier, doesn't it? That guy's gonna die. This guy. Uh, was gonna die. Oh. I don't know what's going on with... Let's see. Oh, blood heal. There we go. And there we go, we bit a hunter, and we're gonna get lots of blood back. Instantaneously. 
wonder if Ash is doing okay. You should be ashamed of yourself, Vampire Hunter Man. He's just fucking kicking the shit out of this guy. Uh, we're almost out of shoddy ammo here, but that's okay. Let's see. Uh, actually, we literally just ran out of shoddy ammo. Let's... Let's get, uh, this one out. Let's see, what do you have? You had a crossbow, so that's a little bit of ammo for us. Can go that way for sure. Just want to see if there's anything else we'd like to pick up here. I don't know if that sword... I don't think that sword's any good for us. We get through here. We can get through there. We want to get through there. I'm curious about what's actually going on over this way. Actually, there's even a door over here. Another crossbow. Let's see if we can unlock this door. Yeah. What's in here? Literally, actually nothing. <laughs> okay. And here we have... Also, pretty much nothing. So... I guess we will go this way. Let's see what's going on behind here, though. This is interesting to me. Hmm. Got another guy here. We'll, uh... Be with him in short order. Um, no, 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 you stop that. There we go. We're actually getting a lot of blood for free somehow. Not sure how that's happening. Maybe an item that we picked up and I just wasn't paying attention. Actually, our blood shield ran out. That's not very good. There we go. It's like one of the first fights we've had in a while here. There's a shotgun of some kind. Anybody else? Is this the last guy? I think you're the last guy, buddy. I'm very sorry to say. Bye bye. That's some good blood. We didn't even know you think we used the odious chalice, or maybe it used itself. I don't know. Good stuff. Anybody else? Let's uh, switch to melee for a bit, just in case uh, we get some more guys, because that would certainly have been easier if we had used melee instead of our guns. Kind of seems like there's nothing over here, so let's go back and uh, double check on... Let's double check on that other path, I guess, real quick, if I can find the, find the way. Where was it? <laughs> Actually, don't even know where we came in. Did we like fall through something or jump down something? <laughs> I guess we can't go back the other way. Well, I just wonder if there are like other guys over there or what. Seems like we are uh, well and truly stuck. In this area. I don't see any exits. Huh. Alright, well, fair enough. This way we go. Oh, no, this is where we came in. Okay. <laughs> uh, I guess maybe there's a door down there. I don't really know. Oh, yeah, I wanted to see... Not that, but the... Uh, that other little hole in the wall that we could crawl through. Just curious what's down here. I actually don't remember. I don't know if we have to crouch to get through that or not, but... Oh, good. Yeah, okay. This is worth it. So I guess we do have to go that other way. Very well. So I guess maybe... I don't know. Maybe this won't be that short of an episode. I think that sword is the same as the sword we're using right now. Can we climb up this ladder? Oh, we can. Okay. That's what we gotta do. My mistake. All right. All right. Blood shield. Got a buff. And let's just cut this guy to pieces. I 
Ah, that guy's dead. And this guy's dead. Good stuff. Now, his crossbows hurt quite a bit. Very effective uh, vampire killing weapon. I think that was the last one. Here. Uh, oh, there we go. You know, I only lived in Hollywood for 10 years. I wonder how long I'll live on in her after I go. Hmm. Uh, yeah, thanks, man. It was as far as I could fall. It was as low as I could go. Way past oblivion to a point only described as negative zero. Uh, and cut, yeah. Cut it out. All right, well, he uh, seems to be doing all right. That's good. That's real good. Got some XP for that, too, which is actually pretty useful because we're a little bit low. We are now in the sewers. Um, Eight XP. Can we talk to Isaac about any of this? Uh, no. So we have to basically... Yeah, we basically just need to go to the house now. So I guess we'll call it an episode here. When we come back, uh, we will go and check out that house in the tape. Uh, and I will probably have restocked on uh, ammo and all that good stuff. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll go from there. So until next time, my name is Ben Rojo, and thanks for watching.